Sir, how, sh how should the students approach the year? Well, uh, you know, look, uh, so there's the, there's the kind of, um, uh, there's the, uh, the, the Bayonne, New Jersey Irishman who is always lurking just beneath the surface, and I'll give you one answer to, you know, to complement that part of me, and then, and then I'll give you the more, uh, you know, uh, erudite, I suppose, answer. These young guys have, and gals have been running hard, right. and so part of this year is for them to take a breath. And they should, you know, they should, inside of their seminar rooms and, or as a class, they should enjoy each other's company, both um, in the classroom and on athletic fields and, and socially. They should take some time with their family, you know. Uh, it, when I was in school, there were, there were deliberately, I would make decisions about, uh, this is going to drive the faculty nuts, but whether I would, you know, do a particular assignment. And if I had a son or a daughter that had a basketball game or a, you know, a student teacher meeting, I went to those things. So that we have, in fact, built in some time that is theirs to manage. And so they have to manage it. Um, on the other side, I, I hope that they um, become more curious this year. There's, there are so many things out there about which they should be genuinely curious, you know. I mean, I, you know, in my job, there's things that I have to know about global economy that just surprise me sometimes, right. you know, the degree to which I need to know something about the global economy or something about the laws that, uh, that shape our approach to this, you know, unaccompanied air alien children crisis on our southern border. Th uh, there's a lot of things that they don't know about that they will be richer if they take some time to just keep learning and be curious. And so they've got, the, they've got a curriculum, and they have to achieve the objectives inside the curriculum. But I hope that they also become broadly curious about what makes the world work, because the jobs that they'll have in the future will require them not just to understand the military instrument of power, but actually how our government functions.